blessed love and peace. One other thing, one other denda to the excitement of this evening uh, is that um, it actually, to be honest, uh, it might be angels. It might be angels. Um, and similarly, it might be demons. Doubt demons, though, because it wasn't much of a temptation. It wasn't much of a threat. It didn't cause much nervousness or fright or anger. Uh, demons tend to be further effective in that response or in that respect. It might be angels, and it might be angels that are like showing something by targeting something in such a way. Now, and it, it might be a combination of things. The thing, though, is that uh, my experience with the angels um, tends to be at, uh, be further subtle um, rather than just so dramatic. Uh, that's my personal experience to date concerning my experience with the angels. My experience concerning my experience. Demons. Uh, my, my general experience with the demons in this life to date is... Um, uh, actually probably similar in terms of like the dramatic behavior uh, but instead it's been a matter of uh, s witnessing like the enslavement witnessing the controls um, and like seeing the person like the uh, like those shell of themselves and instead of it being themselves in control um, like just some sentience with less conscience. Um, like, like somebody like just turned off, the mind's turned off and that person is just in like a robot kind of mode. That's the general experience I've ex that I've had with, with, with demons through the years, uh, in talking with people and they might be violent at that moment. They might be loud. Uh, they might be just silent and just like studying or whatever else and trying to like find calmness. Um, so even when it is demons, it's not a matter of just like it's a green light to say and do whatever. Um, it's always a matter of being respectful, uh, being as compassionate as possible, and addressing whatever the um, the harms are at that moment that are being caused. Uh, So yeah, when, when when witnessing the with the demons, people being controlled by by like demons or spirits or whatever, what the scenario generally is is, is the person just kind of like being blanked out, like almost being like in a zombie, so that they're moving, they seem coherent, but like when talking with them, they're not being they're not they're not being mind they're not being rational. Uh, they might be somewhat coherent and responsive in some ways, but for the most part, it's like kimpuk are gone. Um, and that's where there's some type of conversant, com conversant kind of uh, quality to the interaction. Um, but by and large, it's also often just a matter of person just being silent. Um, and that's it. So, with that said, um, all things are praise of Most High Elohim, blessed love and peace of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala.